welcome back to Project Zomboid Challenges. It's another beautiful day on the island. Except we still don't have a can opener or a hammer. We're running out of weapons. But besides that, everything's great. I have some chips. Very tasty. Alright. We got a metal pipe and a tiny bit of meat cleaver left. Yeah. Get some water, get some food, and head off for the day. Also, the window is broken. That's also something. We eat this pancake mix. No. What else do we have in here? Maple syrup. Oh yeah. Grab a maple syrup. Aw. Oh, only twenty. I guess this is a full maple syrup, and this is a half maple syrup. Something like that. Not worried about it too much either way. Do we have any other weapons we can grab? We've got this pipe and the cleaver. We got another cleaver in here and a pipe wrench. That's pretty much it. That's okay. Let's head out. Two destinations for today. The apartments. And then further afield. If we can just quickly grab ourselves a can opener. That would solve one of our problems, at least. Just seeing what supplies exist. There's definitely plenty of supplies to be had. We just need to actually go to the spots that the actual supplies are in. We got an infinite supply of medical stuff from the medical center hospital right over here. Oh, look at all these guys. They're just gonna see me when I go inside here. The big back windows. That's gonna be a problem. That's alright. Let's see what we can do. We got a lot of broken stuff here. Means so we can grab some more like door pieces. Could be helpful. There's a zombie right here. How would you like to come outside? Very tight corridor corridors here. Tight corridors. He clearly does not have as much range as some other weapons. Unfortunately. Very nice stump. There's a fork in here. That's not gonna help. <laughs> or, not gonna help enough. Right, here's the kitchen. Let's see what we can grab. A fresh apple. Seems already slamming on something. Canned food. Uh, chocolate. Graham crackers. Eat this cocoa powder. Makes it thirsty. Graham powder. Flour. Jerky and cereal. We can always go back. Mac and cheese, too. Okay. Once again, no can opener. Options, though. Are you just slamming on this door? Walk towards it. It's a locked door. Okay. So there's something here. I'm gonna, like, good look through the windows it does help. Stale strawberries, boo. Canned food. Or chips and beef jerky. Again, no can opener. We can look around other parts of the houses too, technically. Right now I'm just worried about this. They got a lot of boxes, they got some fun stuff. Can opener, there we go. Okay. So now we can grab all the canned food and it's just gonna be fantastic. Brown sugar, graham crackers, chug some vegetable oil, always a good time. Some tea bags. Fresh food. Some frozen stuff. Okay. Let's look in other areas here. There's a zombie. And all the other zombies over there. These big back windows are definitely a positive and a negative. Fishing stuff. Huh? What's he got? Sheets? Put those up in my windows. Love that. Some materials, 
scrap stuff, books, metal, dog food, chairs, clothes. See, plenty of slamming over the place. Let's grab a few more random bits here. More closed doors here, too. That's a lot of open windows, though, so we could probably accomplish quite a bit here, anyways. There's still definitely more zombies in here, though. Some of the doors are open. We can't see in as effectively as I'd like. This is a for show one, so it doesn't have as much things in it. That's okay. With all the zombies breaking everything, there's gonna be a lot of available ways to get in places. Alright. Okay. We'll put all this food and sheets away, I guess. And fish and stuff. Frozen, uncooked. Oysters. Alright, they are unfreezing. Probably should get these back. Don't need that. There's definitely plenty more stuff here. Definitely in the food department. That's a good start. So we'll focus on eating the fresh food at this point. It is going to just keep for a while. Be great. We can cook up the frozen stuff. We have a can opener. Technically, we already did have a can opener. It's just over at the other house still. <laughs> so. Would be a venture to get back over to there. Don't really want to deal with right now. Let's see a zombie over here. Try to take care of that one. A little bit too close to the house here. There we go. Hi, nice zombie. Alright. Damn it. He's not nothing. To be expected. Okay. So we got more sheets here. That's gonna help. Should we put a sheet on the back window that's gonna happen all the problems? Potentially. And sheets to the front here. In general, I don't think we're gonna use the front. Just to have less zombies bothering us. And sheet. Make sure we don't press the smash window button. That is not what we want to do. <laughs> really go through here as often. And a sheet to this window. Close the curtains. It's every possibility a zombie would just fall through here. That's okay. Should probably make sure that that actually get rid of all the broken glass here. Just not have it be a problem. Close the curtain. I think we need a. Open the window? No. We tried to. Let me grab some of the ripped sheets. So I can hold that. In order to take the glass here. Grab right that from the inside here. Remove broken glass. There you go. And now close this curtain. Put that stuff back away. She put the frozen stuff into the freezer. It might not be frozen anymore. Fresh uncooked. Fresh uncooked, fresh uncooked. There we go. Got some fresh stuff here. Chips, cereal, carrots, also fresh. Pepper fresh. Beef jerky. Got an apple. We got a can opener. Love it. Put some of the fishing stuff in here. There's definitely plenty of water since we're on an island. So, definitely something we could look into. And transfer the rest of the food into this area. Okay. So we're gonna put the maple syrup in here for now. 
Get out the fresh stuff to use first. Would be the wisest choice. All the stuff in here should be pretty good. Grab some grapes, some cheese, a carrot, and banana. You know, eat some of these. Eat a banana. Just a whole thing. Fill the water bottle. And we're off on an adventure. Let's we'll see further. There's a road going this way that we get past those zombies. I just want to keep walking, get over towards the military. If we get some more weapons, that'd be preferable. We are going to focus on just going out the back door here. There's less potential problems with the back door. We'll need less things towards us. That should be good. Okay. Let's get going. And re-equip the cleaver here. It'll be helpful if we get into any fights. Which is very possible. Alternatively, we could just kind of run past today. I'm trying to cover distance and find places and things more than anything. Something to consider. Okay. There's not a huge map, but there's definitely still plenty of stuff here. Way up here, there's some zombies. I'm gonna just casually stroll around here. Should be able to lose them with a bit of running. Not that we need to, though. Let's just stick a little bit over towards the forest side here. There is the water. There's limitations here. There's a little park here. That's nice. Got some zombies. Well, that's nice. Lots of parks and stuff on this island. If it wasn't for all the zombies, pretty good place. <laughs> if it wasn't for all the zombies. Okay. Another building of some description here. Lots of chairs. Could be a school. So the chairs and desks and everything. There's definitely zombies behind us now. We just got a crowbar. Those guys are chasing us. A few. Maybe a few too many. Currently stands. Run! No! I can never turn around well enough. Alright. Let's see if he's that in here. Alright. <laughs> yeah, it was too many zombies. Kingsmith. New character. Same guy. No. I mean, new character? On the same map? Eh, yeah, maybe. Let's say let's collecting some of these resources. Let's go for it. Alright. We're back in the first house. That's okay. We got another can open here. Grab a few. Grab some food. Bring with us canned beans. Open up some of these. Food is definitely doing fine. Um, what else we got? Here's some chips. We don't need multiple campers. I think we should have a camper back at the house, anyways. So we don't really need to bring a can opener with us. Let's open up these beans. Do we, don't we hate beans? Make us unhappy. <sighs> Put some more stuff. Make some chili. Then everything's great. Open a can of chili. 
open a can of chili. The can opener back in here. I guess we have two over here. I'll bring one more. It's fine. Do we have any water bottles? We got a tumbler of water, bowls of water, and orange soda. Got that. And orange. Anything else we want to bring with us? It's empty. Uh, denim shirt. Where's that? Another jacket with a hole in it. It's fine. Uh, ooh, a duffel bag. That's why we get more of these. Clip on back, duffel bag. And we got storage. We'll grab these shotgun shells. Some bandages. This shotgun. That's about to do it. Goal. Basically, get over to the corpse. Get our stuff back. So some zombies over here. Wild. On the left side, we got new firefighter pants. Those are good. We don't have any weapons. Shouldn't need any weapons. Across here. Stop sprinting quite so much. On the map. So you cut across here. Get to the park. Just keep going. Fought some zombies here previously. Should be alright. I don't think we really had much in the way of actual weapons back in the house anyways. That was kind of one of the problems we were having. <laughs> Into the forest. Also, kind of need to worry about time here. It's another issue. Here's the park. Getting thirsty. I think I have any bottled water. Drink. Or the orange soda. Yeah, that'll work. Just having a soda. Strolling through the park. What a great time. Another duffel bag guy. Oh, this other side of the park we haven't really been to previously. So there's some more zombies. I guess they might have also all moved around a little bit. Because of the helicopter and all that. That's okay. Keep going. Feel sweaty, it's fine. Just need to keep going here. What do we have on our body that we really want? There's definitely a couple of things. We probably destroyed all of the clothes. But we had... Another duffel bag, which is good to have. We had a bunch of fresh food, which is also nice. We had pretty much our only weapons. That'd be good to get back. Oh, these zombies. Stab it. There's the trail there. I like parts in the forest we at least see a little bit forwards. That's nice. It's generally okay. Things could be worse. Maybe. There's some zombies. <sighs> There's the checkpoint or something.
More zombies. Okay. Lots of zombies here on the bridge. Just going to get past them. Go for a nice little run here. Far enough away from these guys that they don't see us anymore. Okay. Should be good. Let's get in here. Get a water bottle. Put away some of the stuff that we brought with us. Grab the backup weapon, essentially. Right. So in here. Grab one water bottle. Can opener, chips, fresh orange here since we opened the cans. There's those. Here's the shotgun shells. We got the bandages. Here's the shotgun. No fit. We got food. We got water. We'll grab the backup cleaver. And that'll get the job done. Quick primary. Drink some of that water. A little bit. Okay. Let's get over to our body, hopefully. It'll be the one with the backpack. Having that crowbar would have been nice. But it's definitely not worth dying over. That's okay. We also lost all of our skills. So we didn't train much. We got the books still, so that's fine. We can move all the skill books back into the we haven't read this books bookcase. That's something. Always looking on the positive side, question mark, <laughs> kinda. Body should be steer still. It is nice continuing in a world, but losing the stuff we've done on the character is definitely inconvenient to say the least. All right. I ran over this way, I think. No, oh, those are us. We went past the park. Let's see where the zombies are at. Some trees in the way here. There's a pile of zombies over here. It's going to include us. Yep, there we are. At some points, there hasn't been the hordes that killed us. In this case, it looks like there kind of still is, unfortunately. And there's still. There's still many zombies here. Where are we at? Well, how did we manage to bring that many zombies at once? They're not us, though. So lure these guys away. It'll be fine. Okay. Pile of zombies. Come over this way. I think we saw ourselves in there. This definitely looks like a school over here. That's neat. Run past all these guys. Let's see if we can get ourselves taken care of. We still need to loot ourselves, though. It's unfortunate. Can we just grab ourselves there? And a few others. There's more zombies in the woods. Alright. We start taking a stand here. There's us. Well, there's no zombies behind us. Oh my gosh. 
Our neck is bit. This could be short-lived retrieval. <laughs> Into here, loot everything. Ow. <laughs> a zombie. This is gonna be a short lived retrieval if our neck is bitten and infected. Use some of our disinfectant. Should be great. The rest of this. Let's see what we can salvage. Probably not much. They destroyed our scarf. That would help with the neck problems we're having. Okay. We're in, we're in a bad way. Let's go and get back to the house now. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> More tiny? Okay. We're right next to a regular restaurant here. Wild. Okay. Can we get everything out of here? It looks like we dropped the cleaver at some point. We were a zombie. Might just be on the ground here somewhere. Probably where we died would make the most sense. If we can get that back, that'd be good. I think it's already not really dirty. Move this and put a new one on. Oh, yeah, it's infected. Okay. Well. <laughs> I swear. See if we can find the cleaver on the ground here. Is that it? That's totally it. Grab. Sprint. <laughs> okay. Well. You have served your purpose, second guy here. You got our stuff back. I died trying. <laughs> Grab those guys' attention. Alright. We're gonna go put this away. Put all of our stuff away. And then run. For, I guess it's still just an infection. Could technically still be okay. In theory. Probably not, though. <laughs> Probably not, though. We put some disinfectant on. We got infinite disinfectant, so. It's not even really a problem. Look at the zombies. What do you think you're doing? Well, it's not my house. Or, <laughs> my house. Don't use that. Just got to hold down. It's got a system here to combat. Some scissors. Ooh, an extra sweater. And not a leather jacket. We should still have infinite leather jackets. That's our control. Right. If we take this off again, it's going to be quickly a mess. Is this even our house? It's the next one. They were over at our house, essentially. Rude zombies. Anyway. Oh, maybe everything's gonna be fine. <laughs> maybe everything's gonna be fine. Okay. Put away stuff here. Got a destroyed scarf here. Got the other meat cleaver, which is not a good situation. We got the old key ring. Jake Fleck is no more though. So all his keys are now. Keys go in keys. Okay. Jake Fleck's key ring. Millicent Blackwell. Right. 
You don't have it? Oh, there they are. Ten random keys. Okay, let's grab some disinfectant here. Got a whole bottle of stuff. It's pretty good. And get this going. Still bleeding. Well, can I not disinfect? Okay. Where's the option to disinfect? Can I grab it? Our neck is not doing good. We're in critical pain. Critical problems. There's no way we're going to be able to sleep with this happening. Okay. It's time. Let's put everything in this cupboard. And try again. We'll, t we'll go for a run. It's going to be great. All the stuff from both of us here. Let's see what it accomplishes. I'm going to go on the journey that I said I was going to go on. Are you still dying? Probably. <laughs> Put everything in here, even though most of it's probably going to have a whole bunch of holes. And the key ring can also go in here. Great. And let's transfer the rest of it. The open food. I mean, we can, we can eat the beans that we hate. That'll get us through the run here. Okay. And the rest is in here. Everything goes in here. And the keyring. For good times. Alright. We're off on a run. We got nothing on us. Here we go. <laughs> I don't expect this neck injury to be okay. Throwing our life away? A little bit. That's the dream, though. I want to see what we can see. Some zombies. Get them out of the forest. A little bit here. Alright. Minor pain, neck injury. It's kind of going up. Kind of sore doing okay. We're hot. Consider taking off clothing. Thirst increased. Really? <laughs> really. Probably from all the running, more than anything. Got like a school here. We're getting thirsty. It's fine. We don't really need more literature or anything from schools, so. That's not a priority. Flowers or something here. This little area around here. This is the police. They can have some stuff. I feel like they'd have more guns than anything. We've scratched our foot. That's bleeding too. That's great. This is why shoes are important. Right. Keep running. We're gonna die yet. That's some. Um, Messy areas over here. More fencing. Lots of vehicles. Entryway into the military section. Okay. Again, I think they're just gonna have more guns, but you can find some like just anything really. Alright. Military. We're getting anxious. Possibly appropriately so. Some military looking guys. Like military armor and stuff can also be good. Let's get through here. This is like the airstrip or something. We need to get to some actual buildings. Hopefully without zombies chasing us. Would be obviously great. 
some more cars over here. That's also pretty good. This is just a parking lot. Alright. Let's keep running. And find a place. Here's a place. Get a bit tired. That's alright. What kind of places we got here? What kind of stuff we got? Storage area. This could be something. This could definitely be something here. Could be a lot of zombies, but it could be. The intense music stopped. <laughs> Definitely zombies around. That's for sure. I think they did break one of the windows or something. Which could allow us to get in there. U.S. Army property. That sounds pretty good. Just, just let us in here. More locked in areas. That's more of an office. This is not what we need. Yeah. Little bar stuck in here. That's pretty fun. I think we more want the supplies than an office, obviously. This is like another big supply area. Some new tower. This is open. Ooh -hoo -hoo. Oh, this is. That's mostly not what we need. This is like for... Yeah, right here, yeah. I think the first... storage area we looked at would have more things we'd want. I'm just gonna look around, though. I wonder if there can be things in these barrels, so... Not particularly helpful. Anything in these? Battery, scissors, no. Nothing helpful, at least. Some lockers over here. Let's have some stuff. Flashlight, radio, no. Both of our feet are bleeding now, so that's helpful. <laughs> so right over this way. Look at tower. This is the very edge here. I don't know if where we get. I don't know if the military really have melee weapons. I mean, enough guns and maybe we could accomplish something, but. It's broken. Here is some guns. Shotguns, stocks. I don't like the story. No. Weird. Yeah, there's definitely a couple guns in here. Really more interested in mana weapons. Okay. Okay. That's what we expected. New character. Fire officer. Next. Night. Yeah, it's night time now. Okay. Well, that's not too helpful, is it? You know what? You... Just need to... We need, we need it to not be night. We need it to not be night time. Hmm. 
Can I make you tired enough by just sprinting all the way back to the house? Potentially. Just take the roads, make things easier on ourselves. A couple lights still existing. Guess that is one potential negative for continuing the world. If there is going to be power and electricity issues. Well, that's probably fine. Going for a run. Having a good time. Lots of zombies here. They got a weapon or something in them. Or a gun or something. Eh. Not really what I want. Yeah, I think the military is definitely gonna have ranged weapons, guns and stuff. Whether or not we can really kind of have some more melee stuff is the issue. Would be great. Going by the pool. More broken windows kind of does solve some problems for us. We're just gonna learn a lot of them more onto the roads and everything here. So it is somewhat problematic. And past the construction site. The crowbar really would have helped. Would have solved some of our problems for a little bit. Instead, just created new problems. Unfortunate. I can't see anything over here. Oh, this area. Oh, these guys. I'm getting tired. Oh, there's a lot of zombies in there. Look at all that. A happening downtown. I don't know if we've been down to this area. I'm very busy. Every place we wouldn't want to go a lot of the time. <laughs> also, extra fitness is helping out. That's nice. Another playground. Running, running, running. Yeah, run through the forest at night. Definitely more dangerous. That's something to mess with. I'm just gonna go this way. Bring a flashlight would help. Have one of those back at the first house. Run, 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 run. It's a bit of a trek back to the second house. Here's the checkpoint. You know, with all these zombies would help. And of course, we need weapons for that. We don't have any firearm skill. Which could be a problem. I want to use all the military's guns. Like, what kind of melee weapons would they even have? Like, machetes or something? I don't know. Alright. A couple of zombies in here. It's fine. I saw some zombies over there, kind of towards the neighbor's house, so. I don't want to get their attention right now. Let's see if we can get back in here. Got a new key ring. And a dream. 
Where did our other guy die? All the way out there. That's fine. Alright. And we're back. Let's grab a few things here. Like the meat cleaver. Maybe. No pipe. A water bottle. Food. Bandages. We did lose a bandage on our corpse. That's unfortunate. Old Bilson's key ring. On to Maxine's key ring. Alright. You attempted things. <laughs> Grab a duffel bag. Let's put that on. No, not, not equip primary. Equip on back. Equip primary meat cleaver. Got the riding helmet. That's doing great. Wear that. We already have, well, we don't have any other shirts. Denim shirt. Wear that. Denim shirt with five holes in it. No. Other fireman's pants. That's good. A shirt. Black digital watch. Should probably grab a few more watches. Just to have those available. Bulletproof vest now has two holes in it. Eh. How much protection is even providing anymore? Let's let's inspect the bulletproof vest here. Upper torso has a hole, lower torso has also 0% protection. And we can't repair that or anything. Alright. So that is dead. We got military boots, military boots. Still wearing military boots, those are fine. Leather jacket with seven holes in it, leather jacket with four holes in it. Yeah, no. Those are dead. Hoodie with five holes. We got polo neck sweater. Wear that. Not that any of these are really helping. We have long socks on for the insulation and wind resistance. I think we could just go for regular socks currently. As long as socks don't protect us or anything. We got carrots. Yeah, the other meat cleaver. Anything else in here have holes? Two more belts. Or else have belts. Okay. These away in here. The things with the holes. Technically, rip these down or something. We don't need a hockey mask on since we already have full protection there. We've got. Was oh, this full? Oh, I was in the right spot. No, 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 no. This is the secondary things box, not the broken stuff box. It's very different spots. You go in here. Broken things. Another scarf we could grab. That'd be good. We got a leather jacket going. Still have not found any gloves. That's okay. Okay. Hole in the scarf. It's absolutely destroyed. Wear a scarf. What kind of shirts do we have? We have a denim shirt and a polo sweater. It's alright. Alright. Let's get some leather jacket going. Helps a little bit. Not enough, though, obviously. Mm -hmm. We have more of these. Three leather jackets. Wear one. For a defense boost. Look at all that. Hands. 
shins, neck is still danger. Overall, slightly better because we got more of the fire fire pants. Just slow us down though. Eh. How slow is this compared to other pants? It's defensive at least. 0.98 for these. To 0 0.82. 0 0.82. Lever deck also makes us combat slower. Let's be the military slower. That's alright. Alright. It is 4 a.m. We're not even tired. Sleep schedule might end up being wildly off here. We didn't run around a bunch. Maybe we could sleep. Not tired enough to sleep. Ugh. Turn on the light in here. We have a book we were reading. Not really. Well. Fixing the sleep schedule. Finding more weapons and hammer. Lots of things to do. Next time. Goodbye.